The German Shepherd, or Alsatian, as British dog lovers call them, is the second most popular dog breed in the United States. This working dog from the herding group features a luxurious double coat that can be anywhere from medium to long and comes in a variety of colors such as the traditional black and tan, solid white or solid black. Their exceptional intelligence and adaptability make them well suited for a wide array of jobs, including police work, service training and, of course, loving companion. This breed gets a bad reputation for aggressive behavior, but in reality, these dogs are more aloof with strangers than aggressive. As with any other breed, reputable breeders and early and consistent training determine the dog's personality. These dogs can alter their personalities to fit their owner and training, so it's up to the owner to show them how they should behave. Like many purebred dogs, German Shepherds are prone to some fairly serious health conditions. One such condition, degenerative myelopathy, is a neurological disease that targets the spinal cord. It tends to come on later in life and leads to reduced mobility. Bloating is another life-threatening concern for this breed, so owners should establish proper eating routines from an early age. Owners can reduce the occurrence of bloating by feeding smaller meals throughout the day, using a dish that forces a dog to eat slowly, use an elevated feeder and prevent heavy exercise for up to two hours after each meal. This breed has a certain level of dignity that many other breeds don't possess, which means you'll have to work for their friendship. Though it may take them longer to bond and make new friends than other dogs, once that friendship is forged, they make extremely loyal companions. These dogs are one of the most intelligent dog breeds, which makes them excel at any job their owner chooses. They are also quite sensitive and hate being left alone. So if you spend much of your time away from home and can't take your dog with you, a German Shepherd is not the right dog for you. Contrary to popular belief, these dogs are not naturally aggressive dogs. One of the biggest myths about this breed is that even if they begin life as docile animals, they will develop aggression. Many times, the public bases its opinion of this breed on dogs that work in jobs that require selective aggressive tendencies, like the kind that is common in police dogs. Training is the most important factor in determining aggression in any dog. Since German Shepherds are so adaptable and eager to please, owners can teach them calm behavior just as easily as aggressive behavior. That's not to say a well-trained German Shepherd will never become aggressive. Any dog who feels threatened may display aggressive behaviors to defend itself. Another myth is that German Shepherds aren't good with kids. On the contrary, they're high energy, Extreme trainability and loyalty are all excellent traits for family pets. Due to their adult size and strength, early training and socialization around children are imperative to prevent injuries. It is also vital that parents teach their children how to interact with dogs safely. Along these lines, German Shepherds also have a bad and unfairly earned reputation for biting. This reputation is another behavior that some owners train into their dogs, leaving all German Shepherds with a bad rap. In reality, Labrador Retrievers account for more bites on a yearly basis than German Shepherds do. For most dogs, biting occurs when they are afraid, so proper training and socialization are imperative to keep your dog from displaying behaviors that could be deemed aggressive. German Shepherds do well on high-quality food formulated especially for large breeds. These dogs tend to have somewhat sensitive stomachs, so they should only eat human food sparingly, if at all. If you do choose to feed your dog table scraps, you should avoid fatty foods and never feed them cooked bones. When dogs eat cooked bones, the bones break into splintery shards that can perforate their stomach or bowels on their way through the digestive system. 
All German Shepherds have a thick double coat consisting of a soft, dense undercoat and a coarse, water-resistant topcoat that is medium to long. Their coat is easy to maintain most of the year by brushing them every few days. Twice a year, they go through a major shedding spree called blowing, a month-long process in which they lose their seasonal undercoat. During the blowing season, you will need to brush your dog daily to avoid matting and hair buildup around the house. Aside from brushing, the maintenance routine for a German Shepherd is straightforward. All you need to do is brush their teeth regularly and trim their nails monthly. This breed is fairly clean with only a slight odor, so they only need bathing a few times a year. Unlike many intelligent breeds, German Shepherds are eager to please their owners, which makes them a joy to train. All herding dogs have a certain level of protectiveness toward their families, so proper training and socialization should start immediately to show them that not every stranger means them harm. German Shepherds are an active breed and require copious amounts of exercise to keep them happy and healthy. Since these dogs are highly intelligent, their exercise choices need not end at walks or backyard play. Dogs and owners alike can enjoy intellectual and agility-based activities like tracking and herding to create an unbreakable bond between them. As with all puppies, weeks 7 to 12 are the most crucial when it comes to proper socialization for German shepherds. If you want your dog to get along well with children or other pets, this is the optimal window to have them accept other members of their new family without many questions. That's not to say you can't teach your dog to get along with kids and other animals down the road, but the more exposure you can give your pup to all types of situations when they are young, the more likely you will be to have a calm, well-adjusted adult dog. German Shepherds don't become adults until they are about three years old. So remember to be patient with your dog even when he looks like he's outgrown his puppyhood.